breaking news! A seasoned cybersecurity analyst just blanked on how to configure a basic firewall rule. Despite years of experience in network security, they were last spotted nervously typing how to allow port 443 into Google before disappearing into the void of outdated stack overflow threads. If you have ever looked at your terminal, questioned your entire career, and thought, am I even qualified for this? Welcome. You're officially experiencing imposter syndrome a rite of passage in cybersecurity. And you're not alone. Every security pro has had that I have no idea what I'm doing moment. If you've never stared at Wireshark output like it's an alien language, or forgotten the difference between symmetric and asymmetric encryption mid-presentation, then congrats. You're either lying or you're an AI bot in a polo shirt giving keynotes at vendor conferences. Here's the truth. Nobody, not even the most battle-hardened security engineers, has it all figured out. The only real difference between a junior analyst and a seasoned pen tester is that the latter knows how to look confused quietly. Everyone's googling commands, rereading documentation, or hunting for that one Reddit post that saved them last time. You think the people running national-scale threat intel platforms don't occasionally bungle their IP tables rules or forget where they put their own private keys? Please. Some of the most brilliant infosec minds out there are still getting their tails kicked by misconfigured YAML files and stubborn permissions errors like it's a boss fight in Elden Ring. Meanwhile, Chad, fresh out of his 10-week bootcamp, is already launching a crypto startup that promises quantum-proof zero-trust authentication on the blockchain. It's fine. Let him cook. The truth is, the field moves faster than anyone can keep up. Now, just when you learn how to harden a system, a new exploit drops that changes everything. Today it's ransomware. Tomorrow it's AI-driven phishing. And don't get too cozy with your current stack, it'll probably be deprecated by next quarter anyway, so if you're overwhelmed, lost in patch notes, or second-guessing your threat model, take a breath. You're doing fine. The secret nobody tells you is that we're all winging it, to some degree, and senior folks just have better Google Foo and the confidence to pretend they meant to run that Nmap scan with the wrong flag. If you've ever panic-fixed a broken config at 3am, forgot the syntax for grep under pressure, or deep-dived into obscure RFCs just to explain something in a meeting, congrats, you're a real cybersecurity professional. And if you're still unsure, just remember, you're only an imposter if someone finds your unencrypted payloads. But if you want to stop feeling like you're constantly winging it and actually know what you're doing, join Hack Academy. We've got everything you need, from full OSCP prep courses, to CompTIA certifications, to hands-on training that takes you from what even is Linux? To confidently exploiting machines in your sleep. Whether you're just starting out or looking to level up, we cover it all. Real-world labs, practical walkthroughs, and guidance that doesn't talk down to you. Because let's be honest, in cybersecurity, no one starts out knowing it all. But with the right training, you'll get there faster. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to go double check how to turn off old file sharing settings again. And hey, maybe hit like and subscribe, or risk forgetting the difference between a password and a passphrase right when it matters most.